if you've been watching the show, y'all will know. Again, we've been talking about this for over a year. And if we if we say that a lot, it's because we have. And oh, and a lot of a lot of us haven't been getting the credit for it. Which burns my britches because when I see people talk about it now, oh, you know what? I just can't stand the Republican Party now. We need to start calling them out. It's like <laughs> <laughs> we've been doing that. Y'all, y'all saying we were negative for doing it, but now y'all can't stand. Oh man, I got called a terrorist for doing it. Right? Yeah, yeah, it's crazy. But um, something happened over the weekend, and I want to play you the video because I saw it last night. But this leads me to believe, and it should lead everybody else to believe, we are not major players anymore. Period. We're not. I didn't see a U.S. person up there at all. In the it's middle. all self-inflicted. It's all so we did it to ourselves. Exactly. Nobody exactly. was busy. He was on a beach in Delaware. <laughs> the Republicans did this by not get, doing their job and standing in, in front of the Democrats. There you right. Go. There you go. It's there easy to go. blame the Democrats. That's not the problem. There you go. There you go. Over the weekend, China, and I lived with this yesterday, on my on my show and actually it was meaning the whole show because I'm trying to get Americans to realize what the hell is going on in the Middle East. We have warships. We don't have tugboats. We have warships in the Middle East right now. We got two. Two big ones. 12,000 soldiers on them. 12,000 soldiers. Did you soldiers. see they were feeding them lobster too? I saw that. I saw that. I did. I saw that. Which means... Like somebody said, you only feed them lobster two things. You ready to go to war or you ready to do something and you want to get, I mean, the lobster looked like it had, it looked like stuffed lobster. <laughs> I mean, that lobster looked was kind of huge. Yeah. But either way, you got two American warships. You got 2,000 Marines that are somewhere on the ground somewhere in Israel. China sent six warships to the Middle East. Six. You know, it's, uh, it's, it's I, I don't like this at all, man. This this is uh, I don't this either. Is, when I saw it, I was like, uh, this I, is a forever war setup. That's well, what I thought, and Wayne too. hit the nail on the head. You just put all these military forces in such proximity to each other. Oh man, yeah. Something bad could happen. It's like in a city. It's like in a city. When you give freaking police departments military stuff, police are alpha males. Police are athletes. They're freaking physical. You put that stuff in the arms room. One of them guys is going to figure out how to get it outside. Right. What happened to what happened to the Bond Army? You remember what happened to the Bond Army that, bonus that uh, army. the Bonus Army that um, that came to D.C. and they and they protested and um, somebody threw a rock or somebody threw. Something at the police. Police turned around and shot one of the soldiers, and then all of a sudden you had mayhem on on the mall. Uh, yep. But That's either the way, that the Veterans Administration was created. Exactly, and sent down to the states so that the states could take care of certain things and stuff, so that so that they wouldn't because you don't want soldiers on the mall. I mean, these people are pissed off anyway. They weren't getting their you money. Know, what it was, was, it was World World War One veterans were promised a bonus, but it wasn't, and World War One was over in 1917, and it wasn't supposed to be paid until 1945. But here we are smack dab in the middle of the Depression, and these people marched, man. They all got together, the veterans, combat yeah. veterans of World War I, marched, marched on Washington and Washington. created a shanty town. And General Duck, du yeah. They had tents, they had they had fires, they they. they yep. It's like they were in the field, okay? It's like they were in the field, and they were there for weeks. Yeah. It wasn't days. It was weeks. 
and, and with all we... our forces in the Middle East, like the last thing we want to be a part of is whatever is going to go down over there. We have no...